Hello. I think I remember what games were good for now. Mindless escapism. Running away, running away, running away from reality. I am going to play a game. I'm going to play a game. The first Codemasters game I ever had bought. Professional ski simulator. For, pro for simulating professional skis. Look, even the quote on the back isn't by David Darling. It's actually by a magazine. So, also, actual C64 screenshots. Uh, which is a nice touch, and they look quite nice. <coughs> so I thought I'd give it a go. And I found it in a box up in the loft while I was putting some other bits up there. I found a box that I didn't realise was still up there. I thought there was a little box up there with some tapes in, and I found that, and that was all Spectrum stuff. Um, let's that. Uh, but I'd kind of forgotten this box, and a lot of the stuff that I found in this big box was stuff that I thought was missing along with my Spectrum. So, uh, fun finding a lot of that stuff again. Still a few things missing, but i.e. the Spectrum. I was a bit disappointed when I got to the bottom of the box and found the Spectrum wasn't lumped in there as well, so still missing that somewhere. If anyone happens to have a Spectrum 128K toast track model that they would like to go to a good home, I wouldn't say no. Um, yeah, alright, shameless begging. Um, let's go with a normal reset and shift. One stop. Not done that for a bit, have we? I've even got the disk drive turned off at the moment. No. Oh, there we go. <coughs> tape was a bit jammed there, but it looks like. Bear in mind, this is probably the first time this tape has moved in about uh, 20 years, 30 years. <laughs> let's be generous. Let's say 20 years. Oh, look at this. Oh, I've left the light on, haven't I? I don't know if you can see that. This just fell off. <laughs> yeah. Price sticker has finally dropped off after all these years. Yeah, don't mind my thumbnail. Bridge End Computer Centre, £1.99. I even have the receipt. Would you believe? Ooh, Pro Ski. Pro Ski. The receipt. <laughs> A handwritten receipt for C64 Pro Simulator. £1.99. Paid cash. Ooh. Grand total. £1.99. Paid cash big spender <laughs> and kept the receipt <laughs> oh dear god oddly um look, I mean look what you were getting for your 199 you got to give it to Codemasters on that front it was all very glossy and professional and you know you got your instructions on both of them notice just done that yeah I've got two inlays one for Spectrum Let's put it the right way up, eh? One for Spectrum, one for Commodore. Um, this one has no quotes on the front of it. Commodore 1... Oops, does. Commodore 1 obviously has Commodore screenshots. Spectrum 1 has... Spectrum 1s, which look roughly the same, but... Blue, like it's all frozen. Also, no quote on the back. And someone's stuck a number 4 on it. <laughs> different games being advertised for the Spectrum depending on what was available yeah, Dizzy, obviously and then the back page is black and white and then the Commodore one different Commodore games for uh, for sale elsewhere oh yeah nice enough I suppose and look, picture of them mm, natural in front of a camera who cares, we're rich uh, yeah, so you've got a fair bit of inlay for your money with Codemasters. So this case is quite well packed together. As a, well, the case hasn't shattered under the strain of of two inlays, a loose price tag, and a paper invoice. <laughs> Very odd that. Uh, yeah, um, oh, who was it? Somebody, when I was uncovering all these and um, tweeting them, 
one of the cats just come in, knocked the door open. I have still got the oh, I've still got the blooming light on as well. Um, oh, Pixel, okay, not too much light coming in then. Who was that, Pixel? I can't see. I got washing hanging up in here all over the bloody place. Isn't isn't winter time lovely? Can't even get the washing done. <laughs> Go to work, dark. Come home, dark. I'm not even seeing the chickens in the daytime now. Not that I was seeing them that often. I'm having to rely on the kids to look after them for us. I can go up there now and again and sort things out, but they're okay otherwise, from what I hear. <sighs> That's the thing, haven't seen them today. Um, what was I looking at? Oh, yeah. Um, oh, God, this is going to be a few days back now, isn't it? I'm trying to scroll back through. It's a bit awkward when you use Twitter a lot. <laughs> you know, instead of like a social life or something. Uh, oh, it's you, is it, Nibs? Da ha! What Kate does on Twitter. Kate Lorimer. I have no idea if you watch my videos. Sorry if you do. Uh, pointed out the um, that this game has great music, apparently. So we shall see. Uh, generally to be trusted. She is a lady of taste. Um, oh, Nibs. Yeah, that's it. Red Rocket. <sighs> Shameless. Let's be tab the way. Stop it. Go on. Ooh, I hope this works after all of this. I just flare. I need to play something. I need to take my mind off stuff. Uh, <clears throat> Everything's just mad at the moment. Just kind of keeping it together as best I can. Doesn't doesn't start a day well when well, aside from the traffic getting to work. Rushing to get to work, trying desperately to get there before nine AM. Make a change. <laughs> Road works outside work. Building work going on nearby. Contractors doing building work in our car park. We pay monthly for the privilege of parking at work. I know some people have to commute and then pay for city parking or anything like that. So, yeah, I'm better off than that. But there are days when you think, why am I paying for parking when I don't get a parking space? You could turn up for work and... Oh, hello, pigs. You turn up for work and then you find, well, I can't park at work. So you go, oh, right, overflow car park. Just down the road. Okay, go park... And there's building work going there and someone's... They filled up half the bays with supplies for the builders. And there's no... So I ended up paying for parking. After ringing the boss going, are there any sp spaces in the car park yet? Oh, no. Why don't you park across the road for a bit in the visitors' bays and... Right. And now I have to come back out of the work and see when there's a space and see if I can shift my car. And so in the end, it's like fuck it. I paid for parking for the day. And I just think, Ugh. I swear, it's like work just seems to. Oh, this is different. The picture's gone. It's reloading in the last few turns. I swear, work just seems to just deliberately do everything it can to wind us all up. Just okay, me mainly, but can't let anyone just get on with stuff. Uh. Ooh. Please enter your name. Shant. Player two. Please enter your name. Um. Nibbler? The only other one, yeah. Should, oh, I was going to say, should there be sound here? That's a bit odd, isn't it? What if you've got more than... Like, what, what if you're all taking turns? There's three of you. It's like rock band, isn't it? Oh yeah, Oliver Twins. Right, but then converted by Highlanders to do the... Andrew Graham. Hello, Andrew, if you're watching. Stuart and Robbie Graham. Robbie Graham. Yeah. To start, press one for one player game, or two for a two player game. But I'll have to get Nibbler a joystick then. Anyway, yeah, kind of 
thoroughly demotivated at work. Well, not really. Just fed up with it. But I'm invested in my work. I just wish they'd get off my back and let me do it. And I know I'm not able to do it at the level that I used to, but you won't find anyone more, what's the word, not dedicated. I suppose something's a bit Boy Scout, but I work there for a reason and it's not just for the for money. I mean, I could go elsewhere for money. It would just be nice to be paid the right amount of money for the work that I do. Uh, uh, just whatever you do just seems to be one thing after another. And I am just kind of... Shit, I'd say hanging on with my fingernails, but I don't have many of them left now. <sighs> it's alright music. Maybe not a classic, but I could see Mind in a Box covering it and doing a really nice version. Something about it's not great. Anyway, let's see. I haven't even looked up the instructions. Oh, one, wasn't it? I haven't even looked up the instructions to see how you play. Pist Salbach. Or how have you pronounce it? Um, hello? No. Am I supposed to be not using Mr. Clicky? Where's Mr. Suzo? Where have I put him? Come here. Come here. Aha, press fire to As in a pink all in one. I'm guessing like Marvel Man. Yeah, we'll go a bit far. Whoa. Oop, crump. I wanted to go. No, I want to go. I've got to go uphill to go through there, haven't I? Oh, God, is this doable? <laughs> I suspect with the slightly blurring effect of a CRT, it might not look quite so dithered. Uh, uh, where am I? Sprite-wise, I'm, I'm thinking Clumsy Colin Action Biker. <laughs> Skier one, shan't. <coughs> okay, let's do that again then. Doot -doot -doot. God, it was like it was having to load them. Can I nudge him? No, but he can nudge me. Great. It's quite fun. It's quite simple, I guess. But it's all very pretty and gets the... Uh, I'll go over here. I'm not going to beat him, am I? But as long as I can kind of keep up... Oh, bum. No, you're going uphill. Stop it. Yeah, okay, it might be a bit awkward to see where you're going. Maybe this is the sprites and the screen was a bit bigger. I'm very conscious of the fact that it seems, the screen seems small, the play area. Like, I'd like to zoom in on it a bit. But then you wouldn't be able to see quite so much of... What's it? Oh, I'm really not making this now, am I? Let's get going. Two seconds. <laughs> Is the main thing to get to the end before the time for out and sod the, the flags? What? I got to the bottom and just went crump straight away. I hadn't turned, did I? Watch the trees. Oh. Uh, it just seems at the moment it's on a downhill stretch you could say it's just there's just one bump after another and I got a bit for work in the morning you know what I'm gonna skip those oh no I'm not gonna skip those flags I've got 19 seconds to get to the end I don't think I've got time to grab those ones as well come on come on stop doing that you just do that there we go, yay! Crump. 
I'm just reacting. What? Disqualified. Even though uh, you have to get them all then. Okay. Yeah, come on, come on, come on. What the? I'm not quite sure why he always goes crump at the end there. It could do with something like Wizard, I wish it could be Christmas every day. As the tune played, couldn't it? Or something. Give it a bit of personality, perhaps. It seems a little sterile. Pretty, but... It really needs something like, uh, Jeffman to got you, or something like that, when you... Or, ah, sod it. <laughs> like, that'll happen. Come on, come on, come on. Whoa! Did you see that? That was like SSX level. Woohoo! Mm, not sure about that jingle. Yeah, weirdly, although I'm kind of... Oh god, how much stuff is there to deal with? I'm not feeling quite as numb as I used to by it. It's just sort of like, really? Seriously? Ah, fuck it. Seems to be a prevailing feeling at the moment, and just, yeah, okay, next, next, whatever. But I've been off my meds now for about three, four weeks now, perhaps, and I was a bit wobbly to start with, but I think I'm clear on that, and I'm a bit clearer headed, but it doesn't change the situation that I'm in that I've got to try and deal with. 55 seconds. Oh, my reward now is to have to do a new track in 5 seconds less. Great. Uh, where am I going? Where am I going? Why is he going up there? Oh, okay. We're doing it like that then. Who put that lump on the bloody slope there like that? Uh, what's that bar there? I've never, I've not noticed those yellow bars. Alpha. Come on. Ah, See, it's it's different to other games. Oh, yeah, for your one ninety nine, you've got something a bit different from the usual. What's this? Is that a... right? That's some kind of jump that I completely stuffed up. As is that. <gasps> Look, I can go behind things there. It's proper three D and everything. He had to hold two more bloody... Oh, and that's it. <laughs> you don't get to end. Bump, that's it. Now, if I... Right, yeah, we start it. No way to choose. You've got to go through each of the levels in turn, then, huh? Yeah, yeah, I didn't crash at the end, but unfortunately the camera's not keeping up with me, which doesn't help matters. So I've got to kind of ski blind here, then, have I? Or let him get first. I don't know, in his all in his all red outfit, I, with the occasional flash of white, I'm thinking it's Santa. They missed a trick, didn't they? Santa versus the Grinch. Uh, apart from, like, I don't think anyone in the late 80s, early 90s in the UK knew about the Grinch, did we? It's a very American. Ooh. See, if the screen had caught, had caught up with me before, it might not have been quite the same story then. I mean, he's got 2,000 points because he came first. If the script... Uh, whatever, don't let it get to you. <sighs> Just sweep it under the carpet. I don't like conflict, but unfortunately, if you ignore conflict all the time and take supposedly the easier... Oh, great. That could be fun to get out of. You end up with a shitload of stuff. Ah, uh, just... Too many shitty things going on that I can do nothing about. And when I try to do anything about it, it all gets worse. So, I'm best off just sitting there, aren't I? On the plus side, Jules is... Uh, 
last hospital appointment seemed to go okay. They're happy enough to just to come back in. Well, after Chris oh, after Christmas. Oh, so we don't have to worry about chemo over Christmas or anything like that. But I don't know. They say no news is good news. Kind of rather know what was going on. I suppose. Yep. Same. <laughs> okay, <laughs> it's the same. We'll see you later. Right. Yeah. That's not the battle, Mark. One more go. This isn't cheering me up, is it? I'm finding it entertaining and it's curious and it's making me think of when I bought it. Uh, maybe I'll have to find a quick disc game to load up to have a go at something. Oh, come on. Uh, yeah, I found uh, quite a, a bunch of uh, fun games, and some of them now I've since had a look on eBay and gone, really? This game supposedly worth 40 quid? Or at least that's what someone wants to charge for it. I'm not making it to the bottom of this one, am I? Move! He won't go! Ah. Flip's sake, man! Or woman. I don't know, the tiny little sprite. Ah, there we go. That's really screwed me up there, hasn't it? And I've completely lost track of what I was saying. Yeah, so even though I'm off the meds, my brain's still fried. No, that's that. Dum, 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 dum. I feel I owe it one more go. I thought there was a game during loading on this. Must have been another... Oh, hang on. What, what? If anyone knows, let me know, because I can't quite remember at the moment, but I'm pretty sure it was a Codemasters game. And you had to put in a security code once it loaded. Um, and if you got it wrong, possibly deliberately, it gave you a different game to play, which was a bit shit. Where you had these people sleepwalking, uh, or zombies, I don't know. And you had to... You had a, four gaps in the scenery, and you could whiz around your... Gap coverer, whatever it was, <laughs> bridge. Uh, to one of four places at a time, so you had to quite kind of juggle all these people to stop them falling down. And that was effectively a free game. I just can't remember what the game it came with was. <laughs> or was that... You could play that during loading and, like, the Delta Mixy load and things like that. You could just press stop on tape and not bother loading the rest of the game. I'm going to have to search that out now just to remind myself what it was. If you know, let me know. Stick it in the comments and maybe I'll be able to see them. I don't know. God, the comments are a friggin' mess, aren't they? Uh, just everything on my system since I had to merge to a G plus account thingy when I'd only just deleted the last one because I didn't bloody use it. Oh, you know, still seven minutes, plenty of time to rant. <laughs> you know, I don't think Google seemed to know or care that some of us want to keep one thing separate from another. You know, you might not want your full name bandied about. And it's not like you're trying to hide from people, because I've been Geigerpunk online for, God, 20 years now? Uh, woo -hoo. And it's like, well, no, I don't want, you know, my YouTube channel's called that. But I don't, it's just, oh, the whole thing is so messed up. Try and play anything on the TV, on the PS3, via the YouTube thing. Keeps wanting to sign me out and sign me back in again and then say, no, no, can't do this, can't do that. No, you'll need to activate again. What? So then I try and act, do it via my tablet and control YouTube. It's quite nice. When it worked before, you could look at stuff on your tablet and go, yeah, send that to the TV onto my PS3, please. Boom. Hey, presto, it comes up and... You could just go, oh, what should we watch this evening? Uh, oh, look, Steve Benway's Friday Talkie. Hi, Steve. 
boom, up it comes on the TV. Brilliant. Now it's a case of I press dump and it says playing on TV. You look at the TV and it's doing nothing. <laughs> and it says, you are signed in. Do you want to sign out again? Not particularly. It's just, oh, uh, I don't know if that's related to the whole Google Plus and comments and all that sort of thing, but it's since I had to change my bloody login, so it had to create a G Plus account for me, that everything is getting horribly, horribly confused and not bloody working. So, bravo there, Google. Do no evil. <sighs> Dicks. Of course, they're not going to take it back, are they? They're, it, big companies, they never admit their mistakes. They'll just blithely carry on. I go, oh no, we had to do this. You know, I understand upgrades have to happen and things have to change at times. Because... Eh, reasons. <laughs> I'm aware these things happen. But, you know, it was working before you made the change. I know it's not just a control Z. But, no one makes major changes to infrastructure without a regression plan in place. Oops. <laughs> Where's that going to stick me now? Really need what's his name, the cloud guy from Mario Kart to pick us up. I'm not getting up this slope now, so now I'm screwed and. Maybe a smidge more play testing on this one and a bit more charisma. Or is that asking too much from Codemasters? I don't know. Bear in mind, their most charismatic character, Dizzy, was basically just a face, wasn't it? So. <laughs> um. Yeah, I think that's probably enough of professional ski simulator now. It's, God, it's quarter past one in the morning. And everyone else is still up. Uh, this is one of the problems. I just don't get it. I don't know why you... Uh, I need sleep. We could just... Uh, let's, let's not get into that one. Anyway, this has been an entertaining distraction, believe it or not. But I think I must be going. So... Hope you enjoyed this one. And I'll catch you on the next one. Don't know what that one will be yet, but I've got a big box to get through. So, should keep me... I would say busy. But probably... Paralysed with indecision is probably more likely. Uh, anyway, yes, I hope you enjoyed looking at Codemasters, Professional Ski Simulator. I'm aware you could probably see that on any other video out there, but I appreciate the fact that you've chosen to listen, listen to my wittering on and giving me the chance to vent. And hopefully it's been vaguely interesting having a little bit of background story about where I bought it and yada yada yada. So, I'll leave it there, and um, like I said, see you on the next one. Thanks for watching.